pinormal taron awa ato ang sanina mura formal formal no so dili ka magluto rong adlawa ang atong buhaton i have invited some of my friends to answer the question there are two points nga nung nakahuna-huna ko mo create ani nga video one is to help and encourage aspiring job applicants para ma-guidance sila or I mean, makakita sila o unsay mga kaaya-aya or mga nindot nga mga um, aspects sa ilahang trabaho nga gustong sudlan. But of course, limited rapod ang mga um, ang ato ang ipakita ron nga mga um, answers. Sa katong question na to, nga, what do you like or love about your job? So meaning, gamay ra ang mga ni-answer. Actually, daghan kong gi contact ng mga friends um, to answer the question, but unfortunately, and of course, nakasabot tano nga ang uban busy, ang uban um, camera shy, ang uban um, nga sila ilahang reasons. Of course, we respect that. Dayon, um, although limited, but hopefully, uh, makahatag yapon o ganang um, idea or inspiration sa ato sa akong giingon, mga aspiring job applicants. Second is to motivate those who are already working. Well, di man nato malikaya no um sa mga naani trabaho sa hay um nagi mga down times. And well, I hope nga kaniya video maka remind nato sa unsa man joy um rason nga no ni trabaho ta. Unya karon di na maglangan, di na nato dugay-dugayon pa. Ready? Go. Hi everyone, I am Anna Marie Alaban, a part-time instructor of Negros Rental State University under the College of Criminal Justice Education and I'm already four years, going four, year, four years in teaching and Miss Rosebell asked me to answer this question What do I like the most or what do I love the most in this job? And as for me, being a Christian, it's very amazing that I've been in this kind of uh, in this kind of area in life, wherein I can expand, I can share my knowledge in terms of Christianity. I can share my knowledge on the part of criminology. Like it's a wide area to enhance your talents as well as your skills in managing your students in dealing with people as well as sharing expanding or enhancing your skills in terms of sharing the word of god towards other people and what i like the most is it's when you touch the hearts of your students it's when you touch their lives and it's like you're already been a part of your of their life and you would create such a wonderful relationship towards your students it's like a friendship there's a friendship there's a family relationship that is being built up and what makes it most exciting is when your students already um, already achieved their dreams or plans in life they would come to you come back to you and 
thank you for what you have done. Thank you for um, one of the reasons that they have achieved their dreams in life. And that is the thing that you cannot compare to any amount that you have received from your job. And the way that you have molded them, not just on mentally, physically, emotionally, but also on spiritual side, that is a great deal that you have influenced the young generation to face whatever circumstances that may come into their lives. So, for me, being a teacher, being a being an instructor, is a great deal, a great uh, opportunity that God has given towards me. So, thank you very much. Hi, I'm Second Lieutenant Julani P. Perez, Philippine Air Force. So, what do I like and love about my job? Well. First things first. Nothing is more fulfilling and gratifying than achieving what you dream and aspired for. Being a soldier requires a lot of sacrifice and patience, compensations, power, reward, authority. Those are just privileges due to the soldier's devotion his duty and accepting the fact that we are not the owners of our private lives anymore and if our ashes are scattered into the four winds that is all part and parcel of our job but this is the path I choose to trudge with it is so fulfilling and heartwarming that because of our humble efforts and selfless sacrifice. We see our countrymen and every Filipino family happy together, enjoying peace and freedom. As the former U.S. President John F. Kennedy said, ask not what your country can do for you, rather ask what you can do for your country. So, as for me, in terms of what I like about my job, I think I could answer that in layers. Because I think, much like everything, uh, there are two sides to every story. There are positive and there are negative. And I think this, I don't necessarily believe that there's this thing called a perfect job. But I think that if one will say that it's the perfect job, I think that the pros overweigh the negatives now. As for me naman, being a probation parole officer, I think the things or the layers that makes me really like about my job is first off, let's just get out of the way yung tenure. I say that's why we <laughs> I know, that's why we get a job in the first place. I say we hope to provide, we hope to live and yeah, there is I don't necessarily think there's a lucrative amount of money, pero ano lang. I found myself enjoying things na I don't necessarily had a chance to enjoy nung hindi pa ako natatrabaho. Next is, another layer would definitely be the nature of the job as to it being really connected to what I studied, studied in college, I uh, studied psychology and yeah it's very much rooted to psychology at law and these things are two things that I really find interesting and yeah uh, being in a field where these two coincide is just something uh, I've, I'm really really fascinated uh, being a being able to witness all the things that I've read come into place or something like that. And lastly is, I think the last layer in why I like my job is the actual nature of social work. Because what is that? I'm really not into that cheesy, uh, that cheesy shit that 
I uh, know it's for the good, it's for rehabilitation. I I really am not into that thing, but but ano eh, nakakataba talaga ng puso when you witness a positive change in your client and you've aided them. Na akala ko nga is ano is is trabaho lang or yeah it's good na there's change but I really thought na it won't affect me but yeah it does put a smile on my face knowing these people have changed and yeah they're doing well in their life and they really didn't waste their second chance na binigyan nila na binigyan sila so yeah I think that's definitely the layers na why I really enjoy my job and yeah it's really I'm very blessed to be in this field my own Adlaw sa tanan, uh, ako si Patrolman Jan Leonokos. Uh, ako nasain karon sa Crisis Response Battalion Region 7. Um, ako graduate ako sa Negros Oriental State University, Yulungan City Campus. Ang akong kurso kay Bachelor of Science in Criminology. So, ako na sulod ko sa akong pagka-police sa edad na kong uh, 21 anyos huwag ako graduate last 2018 huwag sa ginoo take og exam nakapasar man po huwag pang apply kaluhian sa ginoo nakasulod so ang pagpamulis is hingon tang uh, dako sa swildo o tinanay pero kanina nakakibat aning ang risigo sa pag pagpanarbaho so Muna yung gingo nilang uh, ang usaka tiil ni mo is na nasa simenteryo. So, batong basihan ang kuan, uh, practicality. Mabutang dyan na itong uh, PNP ka, insured na dyan na mong kinabuhi. Tumabutang na kong sildo o mabuhi na dyan ka. O kung sa'yo mga panginanghalan ni mo, is mahatag na dyan ni mo sa'yo mong pamilya o sa'yo mong kaugalingon. So, Ang pagpamulis sa dis depende ra sad sa imuha nga pagdawat o sa imong pagpanarbaho if willing ka or kanang kinasingkasing ang imong pagpanarbaho manang wala gyud lang kung passion na kasi imong pagpanarbaho ba passion jud nimo ang pagpamulis sa dugo sa panas sa kalisod is imuha jud nang murag makonvert ra nimo into happiness bisag kapoy duty ka 12 hours or 24 hours pala siya kapoy pero murag makonvert na nyo siya into happiness kay mamay mong love mamay mo ang ganahan sa mong kinabuhi so kung ma istorya lang sa nung uh, mga gidod ka o kalisod kung saan nyo makapot kung saan nyo masuot ni nga uniform mo ng Ako isip ko sa katarong ng polis. Ako kaning ipagtektahan na hindi niya siya mamansahan sa sagot sa paman na binuang sa pagpanarabaho. Na ako isip ko sa kabaguhay ng polis. Proud ko nga ako nakasulod sa PNP. So, ang inaot ko nga dagan sa ma-inspire sa kuha na unta dili babag ang kubrihon kung nakay pangandoy sa kinabuhi mind over body kung kaya sa unahuna kaya sa na sa lawas training mula bayra na sama silang giingon lulubog at lilipas din ang araw ang pain is temporary pero pag naka, naka success, na successful na ka di ani mo feel na worth it at worth it ang tanan o kapuyon ka pahuway pero ayaw quit kay Quitters never win. Mojo na. O winners never quit. Nagang salamat o mabuhay ang tanang kapulisan. Why I love my job? It's because uh, it makes me happy. I love working with young people. I like working with uh, young kids. By the way, I'm a special education teacher here in Maryland, USA. 
um, working with young people just uh, motivate me to keep going and uh, keep and also seeing uh, seeing them uh, fulfill their dreams to that really made me happy so teacher is really a very challenging uh, job but we really have just to uh, continue to move on and uh, keep going and of course I love my job because I love my family too <laughs> and the money speaks a lot but it's not really a lot about money it's about serving young people being with them working with them and also not just working with the young people but also uh, communicating with parents and just you know receiving good feedbacks from parents just made me alive just will so that's why maybe that's why i love my job but i really really love my job it's I consider that's my, I think that's my mission. It's not my first love though. I want to be, I want to be an accountant. I want to be a doctor. <laughs> but, uh, well, I ended up to be a teacher. And now I'm loving it. And I am happy with it. So thank you so much. So that's why I am. That's why I love my job. Thank you.